Super Bowl 48, Seattle Seahawks, Denver Broncos, February 2nd, MetLife Stadium in East Rutherford, New Jersey. It is going down 6.25 p.m. Eastern Time. The best offense and passing game in the league squares off against the best defense and secondary in the league. So let's get to it. Predictions, predictions, predictions. Obviously, one of the biggest topics regarding the Super Bowl has been the weather. Currently, the forecast for the Super Bowl says the temperature will be in the 30s, which could possibly set a new record for the coldest Super Bowl, and it also has a high percent chance of rain and snow showers. Now, we all know rainy conditions favor the Seahawks because they play in Seattle. They are used to rainy conditions. I've lived there before. Trust me, it rains all the time. Peyton Manning was also criticized during the regular season back in December for not playing good in cold weather, but he told the critics to shove it where the sun don't shine. Obviously, he could care less, but we all know the weather will play a factor in Super Bowl 48. So, keys for each team. I believe the key for Seattle is to put pressure on Peyton Manning. Don't let him do what he wants and force him into bad throws. Denver is reliant on their passing game. The key for the Denver Broncos is to limit Marshawn Lynch because in order to put up points, Seattle will have to have a good balance between running and passing. We all know Seattle has a beast defense and Denver has a beast offense, but it's gonna come down to the exact opposite. Can the Seahawks somewhat inconsistent offense win the battle against the Broncos average defense? This game will be a true battle. Predictions, predictions, predictions. Peyton Manning will throw for possibly two touchdowns, but the Seahawks defense will limit everything else. Denver's running back will change his name to no Sean Murray, no yards, as Denver's running game will be almost entirely absent. Seattle will pound the ball early with Marshawn Skittles Lynch and his two to three yard gains in the first half will set up the window for the play action pass and turn into five to six yard gains towards the end of the game. Seattle will prevail over Denver in New Jersey in Super Bowl 48 and Peyton Manning's miracle season won't be finished off with the ring. Final score, Denver 20, Seattle 24. That is just my prediction. However, only time will tell. Sunday, February 2nd, Seahawks, Broncos. I cannot freaking wait. I am so excited and I'm already tired of all the weed jokes surrounding the Super Bowl. So bring it on. This is Easley Jackets, guys. Subscribe and be ready for the highlights and recap videos as soon as the game is over. I'm out of here.